Hello. It is Thursday, December 2nd. Yes. I feel like I have a lot to do today, um, but I'm being very productive. Uh, I edited yesterday's vlog last night, so I didn't have to worry about it today, but it's still, there's a lot to do today. <laughs> Um, I'm struggling though because I realized, um, I'm sorting laundry by the way and getting ready to fold it, but I realized that I've been struggling and usually one of the things that contributes to my struggling is whenever the house is a mess. So it's just cluttered, it's just cluttered, it just needs to be tidied up and cleaned. But I, I realized last night I was really struggling and I was like, why am I struggling? Because the house isn't clean. There's just lots of cluttery things I need to fix. So uh, I need to find time to do that, but I'm struggling because I also want to give myself a creative day. So I think what I probably need to do, I think I'm going to leave cleaning for tomorrow because of the amount of things I had to get done today already. And it's only, it's almost one o'clock. So I, I had to get a lot of stuff done today already. So I already got Aaron's run, ran. I already ran Aaron's, there we go. And I've got a running to-do list. Usually in the mornings I try to, or not, not necessarily in the mornings, but usually I try to kind of brain dump all the tasks that are swirling around in my brain. And now that I have a planner again, I'm trying to kind of organize my time and time block it a lot better. It's challenging for me specifically because I don't really thrive on lists and time blocking, but I just haven't figured out a way to make it work for me yet. So I'm still, still figuring it out. I invested in a Pro Fox, a Fox Pro Planner, Pro Fox Planner. I found it on Amazon and I mean, it's got a Fox, so I mean, can't go wrong, right? Um, uh, yeah, so I, it's actually been helping. I find that I really just use the monthly spreads. Um, I sometimes use the weekly spreads, but not typically. Not that that's really important. It's just how my brain works. So I have a couple of things I know I need to do today. Like to, I need to get the Foxcast news, or sorry, Fox Den newsletter out um, today because that should have been out yesterday, but yesterday was really busy. And I need to uh, do some social media work. So once I get that stuff out of the way, I think uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just kind of let the rest of the day be a creative day. There are some things I need to work on and um, both business wise, but also just personally. So I have a call today, just an art sesh with a friend at some point this afternoon. So I'm gonna work on some things then, but I have to be strategic or uh, plan out what I'm gonna work on exactly. But it'll be good, I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna leave like housework and stuff. I want to dedicate a day to working on household stuff, um, like cleaning <laughs> what I need to clean. I think I'm going to let that be tomorrow or Saturday. I find I tend to clean on Saturdays mostly, and that's just mainly because Henry is not working. Um, I don't remember what I have shared in my first vlog. My first vlog was in like September, I think, early September, late August. So I don't quite remember what I had shared, but Henry works remote. He works from home and he works in our bedroom. So come in. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, <laughs> Mom had a question. Uh, anyways, Henry works in the spare, like in our bedroom during the day. And then his, his relaxing space is behind this curtain, but it's, you know, just a dark void. And I, all my best lighting is in this direction. So I recently, got those curtains to put up and I've actually really been enjoying it because it doesn't, it just kind of closes off any sort of clutter or anything like living space there. I'm probably rambling, but it's fine. Forgot where I was going with that, but yeah, he works over there. I get most of my cleaning done on the weekends because he's not in the bedroom um, working. So I don't have to worry about disturbing him, but that's, that's not really important. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go finish up the last of the laundry and then I'm going to write a newsletter for the Fox Den 
get the Patre the live stream schedule up for Patreon. I feel like I just say, so yeah, so yeah, so yeah. I need to get in my creative gear, yo. I just realized that uh, I ran out of my small mailers. I think I've got one left and uh, I need to prep new ones. So I've got about an hour before I have my art jam with my friend. So I think I'm gonna just spend that hour working on this. Oh, I haven't done the newsletter yet. Okay, I'm gonna write the newsletter and then I'm gonna prep these mailers. In fact, I think it's not quite two yet. Okay. Okay, I have about 15 minutes before it's two, and then that gives me an hour to prep these mailers. I think it's gonna be way less complicated than it has been in the past, because I'm just gonna be using one of these Dread Pirate Brie little sticker mule tape things, and a Do Not Bend sticker on both sides. And I do this because I get, I get such few orders. Oh, sorry, Kita. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You've got to make your presence known. So I, uh, I do this because I don't have much space here in my studio. And, um, as much as I love the act of like, oh, let's package an order together and like pack everything, you know, from the start, I need things to be pre-packed as much as possible. So all I have to do is stuff it in an envelope and print the label and go. Um, because more often than not, there are projects laying around and I don't get an abundance of orders to justify like saving it for one day, setting up a station. I just kind of get trickles of things in, especially for the book dragon. The book dragon sticker I is my top seller. Every week, somebody, like one to five people will purchase a single book dragon sticker. So that means packing up a single sticker to go out in the middle of everything, which I'm totally fine with. I'm so grateful for it. Um, I just, just not feasible to have a set station for it. So I keep things as prepped as possible. So this way I could actually assemble a order in midair if I needed to, I don't need a desk space for it. So that's, that's my incentive behind that. So yeah, anyways, um, I'll check in with you later. Okay, so my lighting is awful, but we're gonna work with it. Uh, it's about six o'clock at night right now. I just got off the phone with my friend. Uh, we ended up not drawing, we just ended up talking, which is, you know, more than okay. And yeah, it was a really good time. So I realized that I didn't do the creative day that I thought I wanted to. See, this is the problem. You want to have creative days, but you have to make it work. Like you have to make the time for it. So I got most of my time sensitive stuff done today. So I'm going to think, I think I'm gonna work on giving myself the creative day tomorrow. Tomorrow is gonna to be primarily art related. So I'm kind of looking forward to that. You would think it wouldn't be hard. You would think that making time for art wouldn't be hard, that it would be the easiest thing in the world. When you're trying to run a business, it's not the case. So I'm going to make myself sit down and make art, also because I have to. There are some like things that I need to be working on artistically. So I'm gonna be making some time to do that. Um, got some deadlines to hit and some things to flesh out and I can't do it if I'm not actually sitting down and working on it. So I just realized that I didn't close this out and there's not a whole lot of footage from today, but it will be what it is. And I keep telling myself, cause I can already feel myself feeling like, oh my God, these are so mundane and boring, but this is just my life and that is okay. Henry's bringing home Chipotle for dinner and I'm so excited, so excited. So that will be really, really nice. And I think we might be watching Wheel of Time. I'm not sure. We started watching it the other night. We watched like the first two episodes. Verdict's still out on whether or not like I can really get into it or not. Um, 
it's not as hard for me it's more so for Henry because he doesn't he doesn't do TV like I do anyways I'm gonna go ahead and close that out here I will check in tomorrow happy vlogmas guys thanks for sticking with it uh see you tomorrow bye